So let's examine the following example that deals with determining the angular momentum and energy of an electron within a hydrogen atom. So let's begin. Suppose we have an electron inside a hydrogen atom whose orbital quantum number L is equal to 5. So we want to determine what the angular momentum is in part A and what the energy is in part B of that electron assuming that the energy of our electron is equal to 13.6 electron volts when our principal quantum number n is equal to 1. So let's begin with part A. So to calculate the angular momentum of the electron we have to apply this equation. So the magnitude magnitude of the angular momentum L squared is equal to h bar squared multiplied by L multiplied by L plus 1, where lowercase l represents the orbital quantum number, and in this case lowercase l is equal to 5. So let's isolate L on the left side by taking the square root of the left and right side. We get the following result. So L is equal to h bar, which which is equal to 1.05 times 10 to negative 34 joules multiplied by seconds and we multiply that by the square root of L which is 5 multiplied by L plus 1 which is 6. So 30 we take the square root of 30 and multiply it by h bar and we get about 5.75 times 10 to negative 34 joules multiplied by seconds is the angular momentum of our electron within orbital quantum number L equals 5. Now, let's move on to part B. To calculate what the energy is, we take our energy for principal quantum number n equals 1 and divide that by n squared. Now, E1 is equal to 13.6 electron volts and n is equal to L minus 1. So we know that L is equal to 5 and 5 minus 1 is equal to 4. So we have 13.6 electron volts divided by 16 and that gives us about 0.85 electron volts. So this is the energy of our electron and this is the angular momentum of that electron when it's found inside the orbital quantum number L equals 5 inside the hydrogen atom.